Uh, Kalthum says, as you told us about water, so that means if the color, taste, smell of water changes naturally, like in some places the water is sour and tastes like salt, so we can use the water for wudu, ghusl, even if taste changes because it's natural, not by putting anything, correct or not? No, it's not correct in a sense. Even if it was changed, not naturally. The scholars say the purity of water is considered pure, providing one, we can describe it as water. Two, three of its characteristics has not been changed by an impurity. And that is the smell, the color, and the taste. Let's go to number one. I have water. Do I call this water? I say, yes, water. If I put a tea bag in it, for a couple of minutes and I take it out. Would you perform wudu with this? No, Sheikh. Why? Is it najis? No, it's not najis. Uh, tea is, is pure. So why will, won't you perform wudu? Because Allah says that we have to perform wudu with water. So this is not water, this is tea. So it has changed its nature to something else. Now, if I have water and someone drops a drop or two of uh, uh, we call it ma word um, uh, uh, flower water or rose um, rose water which has very beautiful smell so mm, smells nice the color is okay i drink it no problem can i perform wudu yeah yeah but it has a, a beautiful scent to it. it it still remains water not like the tea the second thing is changing one of the characteristics with an impurity. So I put a drop or two of urine in it and it becomes a little bit yellowish. I can see the urine. I can see the impurity. This is not permissible because this is najis. So if you have a lake, if you go to the beach, the ocean water, sea water, it's salty. You cannot drink it, but you can perform wudu with it. You have a bucket of water that was stagnant for a while. The taste changed, the color changed, the smell changed, but it's still considered to be water. And it did not change with an impurity. It changed with, with something halal. Like you have a bucket of water that was used to prepare dough and there's flour in it. So when the water comes in, the water becomes a bit whitish, whitish but still water, not dough. It's still Consider it to be water, you can perform wudu with that. And Allah Azza wa Jal knows.